Hello everybody, welcome back again. Meet with me, I am Rufki Mustika, and today we are going to build a flyers. Uh, now, it's going to be a really good video, I think. Um, right, um, there is a rule of building a flyers, then you, today we are, you are going to know the basic of it. Now, um, before you build it, make sure you go to the um, configure, camera control setting, and take everything because it was necessary. Anyway, you go to edit. Now, most of people thinking a flyer is a very, very annoying because it does. It you need to build it very, very carefully, make it very, very incredibly efficient. Otherwise, you just wasting your time building this kind of bot. Because let's face it, it's not easy to build a flyer, and you need all of your time to build it. Which, oh no, which going to make this video a bit longer than what it's supposed to be. Come on, I need to go up, there it is. Um, right, first of all, making a flyer is to push down the, um, to push up the damage boost and then to push down the CPU, cons CPU usability, usability, because, well, that was the basic, that is uh, flyers 101. Um, you got to carry less gun, that means you have to push everything up. Well, anyway, um, right, let's talk about the weapon. Now, normally, uh, flyers need to do choice of a weapon. First thing first is the auto-aim, like LOML, and the second is the bombar, boom, a plasma gun. Some people would say a heavy plasma like Devastator. Some people would choose Ravager, but personally, I love the Ravager. Why? Um, it's light. First thing first. Um, because I'm not a sharp aiming. I'm not really good at aiming. That will give me an advantage of multiple shot. Um, flyers are always going to be. Um, being back and forth every single day every single battle so you need to be something light and fast so yeah i recommend using one of these bad boy um right let's make it like that because we need it um yeah, most of the player is based on, uh, mostly based on three blocks across. Hopefully we can build this one with that limit. Personally, this is my base building of, my best block of a building, but, um, yeah. I need an auto-aim gun, weapon at the front, which is the LOML chip one. Now it's just an example, um, personally I did not recommend it the LML Stinger, I recommended the, pro the LML Viper because it was a lot better than this one. Yes, it was 3 times expensive than this, but okay, let's, let's make it simple to see, to look at. Um, what it is? Oh, there it is. Um, LML Stinger. Um, CPU load 140, best health 56,000, mass speed 560, damage 52,000, um, energy consumption 2,000 and 2,100. Let's see this one. Energy consumption 1,900. It has more damage. It it requires less energy. So yeah, it's not recommended to use L O M L whatever that one that stuck on that plane that stuck on this one. But personally, I would choose the other one. Anyway, um, the rest of the front bit is really is up to you. But personally, I would put L O M L deadly front because if you don't, you're gonna have a trouble the next day. Anyway, um. That is the very basic movement. Right, um, we don't need that bit. We need to put just three because we don't need anything else. Um, the bottom we 
personally I would love to make my fire flyers a lot lighter than what we have right now. Um, <laughs> most of people thinking a flyer need to be armored or can taking taking hit for oh I don't know a flag multiple times dozen time. But I, I don't I don't I'm, I'm not believe in that because flyers supposed to get hit. Anyway, um, now they come very very important part the wing now most of people would put multiple wing because it's a redundancy okay number one rule from um, making a boat making a flying boat is a redundancy and what is a redundancy is to put as much as you can as much wing as you can because well come on you need redundancy if you get certain from the air, you can just glide down back. Otherwise, you are dead. Um, yeah, that was my front bit. We need to remove this bit. Um, again, for light purposes, we need the we need the plane to be absolutely light. Now, the propulsion. I know the plane has. I know the wing has its own propulsion, but we need something more reliable. Oh no. This is out of shape. Hold on. Um, you need to be gone. You need to be gone. You need to be gone. I'm gonna put you there. That would do. Anyway, um, let's talk about the propulsion. Now, propulsion is a bit tricky than what you might think of. Um, some people would say just take things that sh should be there. Um, I disagree. Propulsion is like making your butt is the the point it is uh, the tool to make your butt look more more awesome. Personally I will put propulsion like a trita. I'm not going to put carbon because it's way too expensive and come on, what was the point building things if you can't building it by your own if you uh oh if you can just put it look like someone else's work. So that was the carbon can be. Okay, we're gonna put uh, blocks there, and then let's put the carbon again. No, the cheetah, the thrusters. So the thrusters fit over there. Um, it's something to cover this one because um, <sighs> building a plane is just. Personally, I would love to build a plane every single day, but. Since Robocraft buffed this one and nerfed that one and doing everything they can to make the game balanced, so building a plane is not every, your everyday answer to get more spoiled to win a bad to win a game. It's not. Anyway, um, that was the basic. Uh, we have a propulsion. Personally, I, I'm not going to just going to put two and say right. That's enough. That's good enough for me. Um. I'll put more than just two, but at the moment I will get the video as short as I can, so let's go to the gun. Um, most of the people thinking the gun need to be very, very much. You need a lot of um, choice of a gun, but with a plane you cannot put much choice on the gun because, again, a plane is a very, very delicate. That's why they always build it without any compromise. Well, at least some of you will build it without compromise. Um, if you're a new player, then you should compromise some. But this is the cheapest plane that you can build, and it, I believe it doesn't have any compromise. Right, um, the a weapon, normally, for the bomber to work um, to work like a rapid fire, you need at least. Hold on, let's see. Uh, bomber uh, rapid fire. We put um, there max uh, max fire rate count is four gun, but come on, you're not gonna put exactly four, can you? But what if you can? Uh, I mean, what if you should put exactly four? No, I'm not going to put exactly four. I'm going to put five of them. And this is the way I am building it. Um, this moment it is ruining the mob, the basic model. 
Um, if we throw it that way, it will destroy this other way. Okay, um, this one needs to be gone, and we are going to put you there. Um, this is my basic flyer. Every time I build it, I'm going to put it like this, because this is easier to um, recognize, easier to play. Some people would say it's not make any sense, because it's a plane, it's not going to be easy. Well, it is easy. Just have to build it very carefully. Otherwise, you doom. Um, that is that done. Yeah, to save weight again. I hate to say this to you. Saving weight is the point of building a plane. That's why a middle bit of that place is empty. Okay. Um. Right, that was the front and the back. We need something to cover this one to make it doesn't look like it's a weak bot. Uh, one from there, and then we put one, two, three. Sorry, you have to go on. Can we put you here? We can. Um, we put as many things as possible to cover your um to make up your lights to make up your damage so you can. At least tank, or at least gliding safe to wherever you should go down. Anyway, um, that was the front bit. We're done with that. Uh, this is the back end of the plane. Now, some people would say you need more propulsion, which I am agree. Uh, propulsion need to be somewhere over here. Now there is two choices. You can put. Uh, another cheetah, or you can put leopard, which fit perfectly there and there. Hold on, how much different? One cheetah, one cheetah is 120. One leopard is 120. Has more speed boost than a cheetah. Anyway. It's just a simple math that you should can you should easily get it done in no problem. There is another cheetah. I'll make it wrong. Hold on, um something doesn't right. Ah it doesn't fade over there. There it is. Don't know what happened. Um Yeah, that was the easiest way to build a plane, a flyer. Some people say it's was difficult, or at least it is. But to be as annoying as you can, it's absolutely difficult. Don't worry. That was the point of making a plane. And then this is the most important bit of the puzzle. How did you make rudder? Well, a lot of people think redundancy is the key of building rudder. Personally, I would agree with that. But um yeah that was a rudder anyway put it at the, at the middle um right um <laughs> you're gonna remove this one because we need double rudder at the back you can't make any compromise with uh flyers right we have rudder eagle at here at the bottom bit and then at per bit we're going to put Hawks or Falcon? Let's put Falcon on. Now the idea of making this upper and bottom is because we want to share a hit point. So when something goes wrong, when something get hit, you still can fly. Right, that was the basic of making a flyer. Hold on, we need something else. We need another thruster, a small one at the front bit because Redundancy. Okay, don't forget redundancy. Um, another thruster. We're going to put it inside. Nah, put it up here. Doesn't work. Okay. Um, down. It doesn't fit, does it? It fit perfectly. There, another one. Nope. Right. We need another thrusters down here somewhere. Can we fit a uh, leopard? I hope we can. 
Nope. We can put the app front, but it will make us go upside down when our sails damage. There you go, another one. It fits perfectly. It's like it was supposed to be there. Anyway, let's take it to the test module. Test, please. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, that was how you to build a bot. Um, the basic rule is to make it as light as possible, as agile as possible, and as many CPU as you can, as many energy as you can. Well, you can fix it by putting another module, but come on, not going to compromise your plane. Um, the plane is a bit different than what I expected. It is. Um, pulling me down, but it's not a problem at the moment. It's just a, an example plane. Personally, I love this space, but um, it is too long for this small equipment to fly. It is absolutely too long, but if we make it uh, shorter, probably going to get one shot by a sniper. Anyway, that is my advice of making uh, flyers. Thank you so very much for, for watching and I'll see you guys on the next episode. Goodbye.